Looking across this room, I am seeing exactly what we dreamed of when we started Women to Women. An overwhelming response from a broad spectrum of women who have come together and simply want to help other women and their families. There are nearly 1,000 of us here today. Not only have we grown financially, but we have grown in the number of women in our community who want to leave a permanent legacy of their own by helping other women. Since Women to Women's inception, we have brought our total to nearly $2.4 million in contributions. That means we are only $600,000 away from our initial $3 million goal. As a result of last year's luncheon, the first luncheon ever, we brought in an additional $225,000 in gifts. If we could double that this year, we could nearly reach our initial goal. Some of you, such as our founding donors, who have been listed on the screens and are wearing pins today, have given significantly and early. And to those, we simply say, thank you. Anyone can still become a founding donor at the $25,000 level and be permanently recognized as such until we achieve our initial goal. Others may choose to give each year. If you have not yet supported this effort, today is a great opportunity to do so. We do not feel that we are simply asking you for money. Rather, we feel that we are providing you with an important and meaningful opportunity an opportunity to create your own personal legacy in Greensboro. And in doing so, an opportunity to help women right here where we live. Most of us here know what it's like to have the advantages of being an independent woman with an education and the freedom to seek out the advantages that are available to us and all of the opportunities. It is hard to imagine that right here in our own backyard, women and families have huge challenges in even going to school. We are so fortunate to have all that we have in this country and in our local community, but there are a few who, because of personal difficulties, economic restraints, or living conditions, cannot achieve the way the rest of us are achieving. They have not been able to change the cards they were dealt. Imagine a world where those women and their children can achieve their potential. Imagine how changed our community would be if we could help these women. Just this year alone, Women to Women's grant to the Cherie Janice Jackson Foundation helped 150 women who otherwise might have continued to struggle. So let us help you create not just your legacy, but that may be in honor of someone or in memory of someone that's been special in your life. Let us help you ensure a vibrant, fulfilling future for our daughters and granddaughters and friends. Let us help you help them. The point here today, if you haven't figured it out, is to give. We're asking you to reach into your purses and stretch. There are so many options and levels at which this can be done. A gift of $2,500 will be permanently recognized at Women to Women. You could give that $2,500 over a five-year period. You could even give $100 today and decide what you want your gift to be next year. All gifts at all levels are greatly appreciated. Can you believe that in time, once we've reached and fully funded that $3 million initial goal, that we will be able to grant out $150,000 a year, every year in perpetuity. And that will go to causes that are relevant to women. But remember, Women to Women does not provide the services. Greensboro has many wonderful agencies that do a fine job with that. In a transformative way, Women to Women funds their big picture. And then 
that's how we make a significant impact. Be a part of the fabric of our community, create your legacy, and help ensure the future generations of women and families in Greensboro. Please give generously. There are pledge cards and envelopes on your table. This is the tough part. Um, we're gonna take a few minutes right now and let you look over these, and we will have one of our founding donors come by your tables to collect the gifts. Those founding donors that have agreed to help us, would y'all mind coming up and getting your little purses with the balloons on them, please? Again, thank you all so much for being here with us and for helping us make a vital difference in this community. We really, really appreciate it.